Are we making a uh, AR kit as well? Like uh, uh, like face tracking? Is AR kit for iPhone? So it is for iPhone, but they currently release Android app. Now, the problem with Android app is, is it's just not as accurate. So um, like it's not bad, but it definitely like you 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 would be getting it basically only for eye tracking if that makes sense like as far as eye tracking goes and like you blinking and stuff like that it does a good job but as far as like uh like actually like your mouth shape keys uh the the, the software itself doesn't do a good job and almost anyone that uses ar kit that i've made for they're all using iphones and like with iphones they look pretty good can you still do facial tracking for S VSF? At least that's what I have just used in my Logitech webcam for eye mouth tracking. I guess it's just I'm not like here's the thing. Whenever you're saying VSF, right? VSF is like literally same thing as VRM. Now VRM um, uses as well as like uh, just eye bones basically for eye tracking. It also uses like AR kit based eye tracking, right? So like at this point, it's going to be more so like, do you want this to be like future proof? Where like, if you decide to get an iPhone face tracking, like you're going to have that option as well or not? then like that there, there is then there would do an ar kit and then the, i mean again like if you I, I guess if you're deciding on like whether you should get it or not i mean just ask yourself a question at, at some point are you gonna like try and buy an iphone just to get that facial tracking going if the answer is yes then yeah just do it i guess i mean i can't force you obviously so mm, what's the android called it's called meow face like i can show you real quick like what it does basically here Turn it on. Like how, like how good it is. All right. Um, and just FYI, by the way, I am taking AR kit commission. So if you also want your model to have very cool facial tracking, even though iPhone doesn't necessarily do a super good job, it still does it. Uh, let me use someone that I'll do. Uh, I'll do. I'll do Yenko, I guess. Yeah, Yenko works. So as far as like blinking goes, right? I don't know how you can see it. Like, does it, do I actually, does it actually look left and right? But as far as facial goes, like, especially because I have a beard, like it's like so like weird basically, because again, I have a beard, so it doesn't read my face properly. Like at best I can do is like, just, you know, open mouth and just get the tongue out. Yeah, it just doesn't, it doesn't register my mouth altogether. Okay, let me do it like, if I go like actual close to the camera, let's see. Like it shifts the whole face, meaning that like, it thinks that my face shifted basically. Yeah, like it's, it, I literally have a goatee and like a full face of beard, so. But yeah, it does a okay job. Again, like if I have the camera very close to my face. Ow, 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 ow. Ah. Uh, yeah. Again, it's, it's just not as good as iPhone for sure. But on the other hand, like if you check, like, let's say. Uh, hey, one thing is good about this. I will, I like one thing about that is very cool about this. And you don't even need an AR kit for this. It's how like you just place it like in front of you, right? And, uh, well, first of all, it does read your uh, eyes pretty good, right? Regardless. But what's pretty cool that you can do is... Um, you don't need tracker anymore, basically. Because if I look left and right, it does a very good job at doing that. I don't know how they fucking did that, but look at this. Like, it does like a full fucking 90 degrees turn. Wait, what what if I I'm gonna turn around. Tell me if it like actually works. Did that work? Probably didn't, right? Oh, it comes back to the front. Okay, I see. This is much better than using my webcam. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like it, it does a way better job at iPhone, basically. Again, like as far as like uh eyes go, right? Like looking wait! I, I've never checked it. Okay, tell me how good it is with like looking left and right, okay? I'm gonna do it. Look. 
Okay, I'm gonna look at left, right, up, down, up, down, left, right. All right, left, right, up, down. Oh yeah, like eye tracking is so fucking good with this actually. And I have like this camera like relatively far away from my face. Looking up is almost not visible. But again, like because I have the camera. Okay, I'm gonna get like way too close. All right. I have camera way too close. Let's see if this works. I right, guess ready? Left. Right. Up. Down. Left. Right. Up. Down. Yeah, up is like weird, a little bit weird, but I get it. Let's see if it even activates it. I, and you can actually see uh, like which one it is trying to activate at the same time. I look, I look up. See. It is activating it actually. Okay, it's a little bit weird. I was drunk looking out, so I think you have to subtle uh looking up a blend chip. Yeah. Well well I'm not gonna do it for i uh like iPhone uh fucking uh Android specifically. Like the software still needs to like get better, obviously. But yeah. But yeah, like I'm probably gonna rig my new model with AR kit. Not even probably. I will model my model with re AR kit, and I'll be using VC face for uh, streams instead of having <clears throat> instead of having like a tracker on my head. This is like so much better. Like all you have to do is like again, like just a phone, right? Uh, have it constantly charging during the stream or whatever, right? So it just doesn't run out of battery or whatever the fuck. And like, that's it. Like, it's just so much fucking easier. And then like, it tracks your, uh, like one thing that I really like is how it tracks like your eye movement pretty good. And then you can just do like voice based, basically. If you just do voice based mouth shapes, like you're fine. Well, chill cut, you're, you're a fucking female. You have a clear face. I have a fucking beard, all right? So it's not gonna register like fucking lower part of my fucking mouth or lower part of my face whatsoever eye and eyebrow tracking yeah, well again like you can compensate the bad mouth uh, tracking with uh, voice based basically so why the fuck not he's better than i well you haven't like i would i would i would disagree with that but sure i would still imagine like something like iphones uh like it's literally a technology like a face fucking reading technology so if that does it bad then i don't know what does good and then Android is still gonna be like camera based, basically. Camera based tracking is not bad, but it's more so like on a software side of things. Well, it's it's like, yeah, it's more so on the software side of things. Like it has to like do like some AI, AI learning basically to detect what you're actually doing. But again, even then it's gonna just guess what you're doing, not gonna do exactly what you're doing. It's still good though. I mean, I feel like what this app needs is like it needs smoothing basically. So like whenever shape keys are happening for there to be like some kind of smoothing happening basically. If it if it can have it as an option, right? Shape key smoothing or some shit like that. I feel like in that case it would be pretty fucking good cuz I mean it already has some but it needs like a slider. It needs to really have a slider basically. So you can like control like how much you want your stuff to and I move around. All right, this butt is uh, pretty good. Everything is pretty good. Stomach.